We're here in Jeddah to a big announcement for Lucid, announcing your first plant outside the United States, and mm -hmm. you decided to put it right here in the kingdom. Mm. Indeed, a seminal moment, both for the company and for the kingdom. Uh, Lucid Motors' first uh, move internationally, international manufacturing plant here in the kingdom, and, and the genesis of a motor industry here in a country famed for its oil resources, committed to going to sustainable mobility. Yeah, it's incredible, actually, when you think about it against that sort of panacea of history. But this move mm. by Saudi Arabia uh, to move into electric vehicles to really accelerate their own transition uh, into clean energies mm. um, is something that they've been talking about for several years now. And this is a big move for them of implementation. I think it's profound. And I think here is the, uh, the, the uh, connection that there is an alignment with the Saudi Vision 2030 and the mission of Lucid Motors to really catalyze mankind's transition to sustainable mobility. What does this mean for your bottom line as a company in terms of how quickly you're going to be able to produce these vehicles and where are the markets you're looking to service from this particular plant? Well, it means that we've got a really bright future because with 150,000 units capacity here and we add that to the 350,000 uh, capacity capability that we'll have in Arizona mid-decade, that means we can accelerate uh, plans to produce half a million cars a year from what was going to be 2030 to mid-decade and that's really important because the planet can't wait. Yeah, when you think about that with regards to the energy crisis that we see the world experiencing right now, mm. a few months ago mm. we were talking about supply chain issues, mm. we're still talking about them but now mm. we're talking about oil prices that for many Americans mm. are just not sustainable. What does exactly. that mean for what you guys are trying to do? Well I think it really just fuels the transition to battery electric vehicles. If the demand wasn't big enough before, the demand is now multiplying. We've secured over 30,000 reservations. We've also got 50 to 100,000 reservations secured from uh, the Kingdom, from, from, from the, 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 the Finance Ministry of Saudi Arabia. Uh, but what's really important here is that this is a technology play. It's a tech race. And our technology means our cars are more efficient, which means we can go further with less batteries. And that means that we can produce more electric cars for a limited world resource in minerals such as nickel, manganese, cobalt, and we can have less draw of electrons off the grid because each of our cars will go further for less electricity.